this is Mafia 97 and today I am going to show you how to connect your PS4 with a monitor which is, uh, which does not have a HDMI port or which is sub HD or how to connect a PS4 via a VGA or DVI cable. Today I am going to show you how to connect uh, via VGA cable. So guys this is the cable. This is the HDMI to VGA cable plus audio. Here is the VGA port. Here is the audio line which is broken in my port because it is a low quality port. The main thing uh, which you have to consider while buying such cable is that it should be H HDCP compliant. So uh, compatible or compliant I don't know what the word is. It should be HDCP compatible because the PS4 doesn't show any uh, video output uh, without the HDCP compatible cable etc so what you have to do just connect uh, this cable into the HDMI port of your PS4 like this so the cable is now connected now uh, you have to connect the <laughs> VGA cable to your monitor and this port this end of the port uh, I will con uh, connect my PS4 to my monitor my monitor is a my mo monitor is a, a Samsung touch of color sync master uh, monitor uh, it is quite old support 16 is to 10 resolution so you uh, now you know that a PS4 is com able to run on a 16 is to 10 monitor also the resolution is six, uh, 1680 into 1050 so yeah this cable helps a lot if you, uh, you have only monitors at your house no HD, HDTV or your HDTV are quite busy so this helps to connect uh, your PS4 with a monitor very easy to do uh, I'll just show you by uh, first let me connect my PS4 with the uh, with the monitor and supplied power thank you guys wait so guys I have connected my PS4 with my monitor via the HDMI to VGA cable and the VGA cable is connected to my uh, monitor here behind and uh, uh, the other end is connected to the HDMI to VGA cable uh, and the HDMI goes into the PS4 I have connected the power and internet to the PS4 now the first thing you have to do is uh, uh, press the power button of PS4 but don't leave it press it for around 10 seconds you will hear beep twice see now the PS4 has beep twice uh, now it will go into the recovery menu so this is the recovery menu uh, of the PS4 as you can see the PS4 detected my monitor but my monitor says it is not compatible uh, with the optimum res resolution so let me connect my, uh, uh, <laughs> my DS4 uh, with my PS4 so guys I have connected my DS4 with my PS4 uh, with the USB cable which is important, uh, important uh, when we are in the recovery menu now all I have to do is press the PS button so as you can see I uh, I just had to uh, switch off and switch on my monitor because it went to sleep uh, okay as you can see this is the safe mode and I can use it uh, while the DS4 so what you have to do uh, to get the proper resolution on your monitor which is a sub HD or less than HD is uh, go to change resolution and this message will pop up so your PS4 will reboot now my PS4 is rebooting here you can see that it is rebooting uh, this technique is also helpful if you have a single monitor and want to use with 
it with the uh, computer and PS4. Only single button. Uh, uh, you have to press only a single button to change between uh, the your monitor, your PS4 and your computer. So as you can see, my PS4 has booted into 480p resolution. Uh, now to change the resolution, again I have to use my DS4. See, my DS4 has connected. Go to settings. settings sound and screen video output settings now uh, here you have to change the resolution to uh, since my uh, monitor is less than one uh, one zero eight zero p i have to go for 720p anything above 720p uh, will result in a black screen and i have to do the whole process again so guys be careful if your uh, monitor is less than 1080p just uh, go for 720p don't try to go for 1080p uh, as that will make the uh, that that will make the resolution default for ps4 and you have to repeat the whole process again so guys this is my ps4 running on my computer monitor which uh, is uh, 1680 by uh, a 1050 not full HD doesn't support HDMI connected via VGA cable uh, uh, the, pro, uh, the audio could also be uh, provided with the cable but my cable is already broken it is a local cable not good quality uh, so you can use a DS4 3.5 mm jack uh, to supply for the uh, to provide for the audio so guys this is how you connect the PS4 with the monitor via VJ cable and which is not even full HD. Thanks guys for watching. Subscribe, like and share for more such videos. Please comment what you think about this video and hope the video was and I hope that the video was of good quality. Thank you and have a nice day.